Hey everyone, it's Shannon. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back for a brand new video. So for today's video, I've got you guys a little moving back to uni slash post lockdown glow up vlog. So as you guys may or may not know, I am already back at uni. However, I went to edit this video and I absolutely hated the original intro. So I'm refilming it. But yes, in this vlog, I'm going to be testing you guys out a new fake tan, which is insane. So a mini little hair transformation, a move back to uni food shop, first kind of like proper night out back at uni, just a bunch of stuff. So I really hope you guys do enjoy this video if you do then please make sure to smash the like button and of course subscribe down below and other than that let's just get into the video so hi everyone please excuse the state of me right now i'm no tan no makeup i feel pale as anything so the little going back to uni slash post lockdown kind of glow up is beginning and i have got a new fake tan to test out for you guys i've not tried this brand before so i'm going to give you guys my full opinion on it centro pay have actually sent me out some bits to try out we are going to be trying the tan and then the fake Face mist today. I used the tan remover to get my tan off and it worked really well, but I'm going to be testing these two out for you guys. So we have got the Ultimate Glow Kit, which is like a cream kind of mousse tan to test. And then we have got the Facial Bronzing Water, which looks insane. It also says a new tropical scent. So I'm really, really excited to try this. I just love having a tanned face. So these are products we're going to try. So we're going to test out the mousse. Now I have never tried Centro Hay before, so this is so exciting. You guys know how I feel about fake tan. I love fake tan i'm so excited to put a fresh layer of fake tan on as you guys can probably tell so i'm gonna read you guys what it says because i love reading all the claims that the tan makes is that Make an instant tint without the harmful effects of uv rays the ultra lush yet weightless whipped cream mousse is enriched with triple action moistures and antioxidants to glide over skin hydrating plumping and protecting as it goes touch dry in at seconds for ease and speed of application you can wear it all day or wash it off as you prefer and glow with confidence all week long i'm so excited about this i'm literally getting my hair done in a couple of hours but i need a layer of tan on so i'm so glad i can just pop this on hopefully it's gonna be dry hopefully i can just wear my normal outfit i'm really excited to test that out so in this little box you get a tanning mitt and then you get the mousse it honestly it smells insane so i'm gonna apply this now and then show you guys like the first kind of color that it gives just wanted to quickly do you guys like a little overview of what my arm is looking like before i apply the tan i've literally got no tan on right now that tan remover rubbed off my tan so well guys i think i might have found my new favorite tan this has the most unreal freaking color i'm obsessed and i can literally touch it put clothes on go out do my thing i'm gonna show you guys like not in direct light but like i'm actually obsessed not only that is super glowy as well no i didn't show you guys my leg before but just look how insane that color is so i am now gonna try some of the face mist i'm just gonna spray a little bit so we can smell it oh my god that smells insane it smells like a holocaust spray and also guys can we just appreciate like the mist on this i'm probably gonna look awful when i do this but i'm gonna keep you guys updated how this develops and stuff but now i am going to get my hair done i'm literally gonna be leaving in like 10 minutes i'm so excited so are we seeing these roots oh i bet my hair looks awful because it is kind of like a little bit greasy I'll tell you guys what i think i want and then i feel like it always does always change when you get to the hairdressers but i think i want a root blend because as you guys know i'm on a hair care mission and then have like a couple of bits at the front like lighter to the root if that makes sense and i don't necessarily want curtain bangs i feel like i like the aesthetic i love seeing girls hair with curtain bangs because i think they just look sick however i feel like i just want not curtain bangs but like face framing layers is that what i want to see my hair a little bit or something because i do actually want to be able to wear my hair naturally but i just hate it so much because it's just so short and just flat and just oh i have just had my hair done i feel like the lighting's gonna be so dodgy so i will pop some pictures on the screen i am obsessed obviously i would love to be like full blonde right now however it's just not realistic when i want to grow my hair so freaking obsessed with the color i know it's gonna match my extensions so well it's such a vibe like i say i'll pop some photos on the screen and also i've not had my hair curly in so long okay can we just appreciate the face down for a minute i honestly just looking back at this clip and i'm like oh my god i'm in love so it's so nice to just embrace the curls i love it i have just come to my nan's for a nice cup of tea to see my nan and granddad as obviously i'm going back to uni tomorrow so i just wanted to say a nice little goodbye have a nice little cup of tea with them and then i'm gonna get cal from work at nine and we have got takeaway night tonight which i'm so excited about i was like i've got to have a final takeaway before i go back and last week we had chinese so i was like this week we can have a curry it's been a minute since i've last vlogged 
cover. I've just come to Tesco to do my uni food shop, which I know is so late. Literally half 10, but I need to do it today because I just can't be bothered to go and do it whilst I'm at uni. So I am going to bring you guys along, try and film as much as I can. However, it's literally half 10. You know, we just want to get to bed. I'll get some sweet potatoes because I'm sweet potato obsessed. If anyone knows me, you know I'm literally sweet corn obsessed. So my surely is starting to fill up a bit. My favorite meal is like bagels, avocado and egg. And that is my food shop done. Oh my God. So I have not picked up the camera since I went to Tesco to do my food shop. I moved back in yesterday. My mum was working until just for like three. So we didn't get up here till six. And then I went straight out to see my friends. So I just hadn't had a chance to stop. I had such a hectic day yesterday. You guys know how unorganized I am. I didn't get near enough and stuff done as I wanted to, but I am back at uni. Guys, like my room looks quite clean from here, but wait until I freaking turn around and show you guys the amount of stuff I've got to unpack. It's my friend Maisie's birthday today. So we are going for a little bottomless brunch at Turtle Bay. I thought it would be so fun to bring you guys along. One of my like first little proper outings. Actually have our table booked for 1.45, I'm pretty sure. And it's literally gone 12, I think. And I'm not even started getting ready yet. So wish me luck. But this is the current mess I'm dealing with. Like how bad is that? All them bags here and then all my case full of just like all my toiletries and stuff i am honestly not ready to unpack this like that's the next week job although shan's coming down at the weekend so i mean i can't be leaving that till next week but the next time you'll see me i'm hopefully gonna be looking a little bit more presentable so i am now ready i'm actually very late i shouldn't even be doing this can you even see my outfit from here no <laughs> that's brilliant wait let me send you guys oh, on the toaster I mean, you're on the toast, so that's safe. But I've just got this little blazer dress on from Missy Empire. Oh my God, I did not even update you guys on the tan. As you can see, I'm literally glowing. I've got the tan on now and it's insane. I think cycling shorts, my little Zara high tops. And then my little Zara bowling bag. I was literally having like a little outfit meltdown. Um, so I'm not 100% keen on it, but I feel like it's cute. So we are at Turtle Bay with all the girls. It's Maisie's birthday. <laughs> and we have got the food actually looks so good. For some bed for our Gino. Someone say bed for our Gino. 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 since I've last like filmed and spoke to you guys. So I hope you're all well. I am now obsessed with using rollers. How cute, like I'm actually embracing the short hair. I feel like I haven't probably given you guys like a hair overview since I've had it done. I'm obsessed with it. I mean, I do definitely want it longer, but basically recently I've just been putting like two rollers in the top of my hair and then just like, curling at the ends. And then also I feel like I haven't really spoken about my experiences with the tan as well. So I actually have it on now and it is just the most insane thing. I put it on, I go out, I can put it on, leave it all day. It's honestly my new favorite tan, especially the face mist as well. It gives such a nice like little glow. I am about to go out for some drinks and it is absolutely freezing. Um, and everyone wants to dress nice. And I'm like, how am I gonna dress nice when it's really cold? So I'll show you guys my outfit. But this top is from a pretty little thing. Then I've got these Zara wide leg jeans on. I actually got leggings on underneath this, like my little Zara leggings, because trust me, when I tell you it's cold, it is cold. And then I've got my like big, long black maxi puffer that I'm gonna wear. And I'm also taking a hoodie in a big bag. I feel like everything's been really hectic since I've moved back to uni and trying to get myself into a little routine has 
It's been stressful, as you guys can probably tell, like I'm not really in a routine yet. I have another for me, so please bear with me my content. I've also got a massive collective haul coming on Sunday, which I'm so excited about. I've got PLT, ASOS, Opoly, Missy Empire. I've just got a massive load of stuff that I just can't wait to show you guys. I also bought some things because I'm kind of trying to a little bit of like a new style kind of a new style i don't know but we will see make sure you come back for sunday's video to see that because i'm trying out some new things all i'm gonna say is maybe some low-waisted jeans if you haven't seen the vlog that went up the other day i have also got new nails which i will show you guys i have not had acrylic since like before covid which is crazy I mean, they are a little bit long like i'm trying to do stuff and i can't really do a lot with them um but they are i just love like the pink and orange vibe i really hope you guys did enjoy this little like mini glow up vlog and guys you need to try rollers like if you haven't tried rollers yet you need to try them if you did enjoy this video then please make sure to smash my button and of course subscribe down below yeah i will see you all on sunday for my brand new video